in this question it is given that a cross b is equal to b cross c and is equal to c cross a and we need to find the value of a plus b plus c so here we can write a cross b as minus b cross a and b cross c we can write it as this again becomes equal to minus c cross b similarly c cross a can be written as minus a cross c here also we can a cross b will be equal to this negative and this of negative okay now how to find this a vector plus b vector plus c vector so first do cross multiplication with a vector okay you will get it as a cross a plus a cross b plus a cross c when you do a cross a is nothing but zero we have also discussed the property of the vector product this becomes zero and a cross b becomes a cross b only and a cross c can be written as a cross c can be written as negative of c cross a right a cross c can be written as negative of c cross a now this a cross b is equal to c cross a this this a cross b is equal to c cross a now when you cancel each other the output you will get as zero so zero is the required answer to this question next a vector b vector and c vector are given and we need to find a vector d which is perpendicular to both vectors c and b and there is also a condition given that is d dot a will be 21 so to solve this question there are two methods the first method method one will be it is given that d vector is perpendicular to both c and b so it becomes d dot c will be zero and uh, d dot b will also be zero and d dot a is given in the question that is 21 now assume let d vector will be some x i cap plus y j cap plus z k cap now in the d vector there are three unknowns that is x y z and there are three equations to solve this variables and after getting x y z just substitute over in the d vector and you will get the vector d now next method 2 method 1 is all about the dot product method 2 c it's given as vector d is perpendicular to both both is the hint over here both c and b so we can write it as let d vector becomes some lambda times lambda is a scalar quantity over here c cross b so next time onwards in any question if it is given as perpendicular to both then you can write the equation as lambda times of the cross product of vectors okay from here you can get it as lambda c cross b is nothing but i j k what is c it is 3 1 minus 1 b is 1 minus 4 and 5 now just take the determinant of this you will get it as lambda uh, i of 5 minus 4 it is plus i cap minus j 15 plus 1 16 plus k cap minus 12 minus 1 minus 13 so this is the d vector that is nothing but 
lambda i cap minus 16 lambda j cap minus 13 lambda k cap. This is the d vector and this is the equation 1. And there is in the question it is given as d dot a is 21. So just do the dot product that is d dot a becomes uh, lambda into 4, 4 lambda minus 16 pi za minus 80 lambda minus sorry minus into minus plus 13 lambda and this is equal to 21 63 lambda minus right minus 63 lambda equal to 21 and lambda will be minus 1 by 3 now just substitute this lambda in equation 1 from here we will get it as d vector as minus 1 by 3 into i cap minus 16 j cap minus 13 k so this is the required d vector to this question in this question it is given that a vector b vector and c vector we need to find a unit vector which is perpendicular to both the vectors both the vectors a minus b and c minus b so how can you find the unit vector by using the cross product so first let's assume some u vector as a minus b so just sub, uh, subtract the vectors you will get it as minus i cap plus j cap plus k cap and assume some v vector as c minus b so subtract it you will get it as plus i minus 5 j cap minus 5 k cap then what will be the unit vector unit vector is nothing but u cross v upon its magnitude right so how can you find the u cross v value using the determinant that is i j k cap u is nothing but minus 1 1 1 v coordinates 1 minus 5 minus 5 just take the determinant of this you will get it as uh, minus 5 plus 5 0 minus j cap 5 minus 1 4 plus k cap 5 minus 1 4 so it's like minus 4 j cap plus 4 k cap so it will be minus 4 j cap minus k cap upon its magnitude is nothing but 4 square 16 and 4 square 16 it becomes minus 4 of j cap minus k cap uh, root 32 is nothing but 4 root 2 4 and 4 gets cancelled the final answer will be minus 1 by root 2 into j cap minus k cap so this is the required unit vector which is perpendicular to both a minus b vector and c minus b 